Hi. So we have one more work and time related problem. The statement says A does 8 by 15 part of the work in 8 days and the remaining work is finished with the assistance of B in 4 days. How long will B take to do the work alone? So we have to find the time taken by B to finish the job alone. So first let's proceed systematically as the statement is saying. Let's first assume the working capacity of A is A and working capacity of B as B. Right? So in 8 days work done by A where capital A is the working capacity of A. The working capacity is the work done by A in one day. So in 8 days he'll do 8 multiplied by A amount of work. This is equal to 8 by 15. Right? Yes. And if we divide both sides by 8, we will get A is equal to 1 by 15. Right? Yes. So we have got the working capacity of A, which is 1 by 15. That means the work done by A in one day is 1 by 15th part of the job. Right? And what they are saying? They are saying the remaining work is finished with the assistance of B in 4 days. So when A works for 8 days, he does 8 15th part of the job. So the remaining work will be 1 minus 8 by 15. This will be equal to 15 will be LCM and we can consider 1 as denominator of any number. Any number divided by 1 will give the number itself. So 15 divided by 1 is 15. 15 multiplied by 1 is 15 minus 15 divided by 15 is 1. 1 multiplied by 8 is 8. So this will be equal to 7 by 15. 7 by 15 part of the work is still remaining. Right? And and what they say? They say that A and B together, if they work for 4 days, they will finish this job. So that means 4 times A plus B, they are able to do this remaining job which is 7 by 15. Right? Or from here we will get A plus B is equal to 7 by 15 multiplied by 4. This is equal to 7 by 60. Right? Yes. And what is the working capacity of A? Working capacity of A is 1 by 15 from equation number 1. Right? So if I substitute that over here, we will get 1 by 15 plus B is equal to 7 by 60 or B is equal to 7 by 60 minus 1 by 15 and LCM of 60 and 15 will be 60. 60 divided by 60 is 1. 1 multiplied by 7 is 7. 60 divided by 15 is 4 and 4 multiplied by 1 is 4 itself. So this will be equal to 3 by 60. This can be solved further as 3 ones are 3, 3 to the 6 and 0. So from here we have got B is equal to 1 by 20. That is the working capacity of B is 1 by 20. He is able to finish 1 20th part of the job in one day. So B will take 20 days to finish the job. This is assuming that B works at a constant speed. So this is the required result which we were looking for.